Let's talk about how a tracheostomy actually works. Trachs are placed in a surgically created neck opening below the larynx that go directly into the trachea, which makes sense because if you break apart the word tracheostomy, trach is referring to the trachea and ostomy means a surgically created opening. A tube is then placed into the opening to allow a person to breathe when there's maybe a sudden blockage in the mouth or throat or if a patient needs to be mechanically ventilated. Some tubes have an inflatable cuff near the bottom that is filled with air to prevent the trach from coming out of the trachea. The cuff may also be deflated in some situations. Once the tube is securely in place, we need something to help it so it doesn't come out of the patient's neck. So we use straps or ties that go around the patient's neck again to secure the trach. And that's a quick overview of how trachs work. What should you do if a patient's trach becomes dislodged? Let me know in the comments. Happy studying future nurses.